at first I wasn't sure if Elmer Fudd would make a good Cupid, but having watched the stupid Cupid, I actually think he makes a pretty good Cupid. This is the 1944 Warner Brothers cartoons directed by Frank Tashlin with a story by Warren Foster. And Mel Blanc voices Daffy Duck and Elmer Fudd, of course. And Elmer Fudd is shooting arrows at various farm animals, mostly birds, and one of those animals is Daffy Duck. And Daffy Duck ends up falling in love with this chicken. But this chicken already has a male love interest and Daffy Duck's very much getting in the way of that. Daffy Duck's safety looks very threatened, but of course he's so smitten because of Cupid's arrow that he can't see any of this. And he will stop at nothing to get the girl, to get the chicken. It wasn't too bad. I didn't love the cartoon. I didn't think it was very funny. There were not many gags in it that stood out to me or anything that I found overly fun or quirky or interesting except for Elmer Fudd himself. As I said, when I kind of, before I watched it, I was aware that Elmer Fudd was going to be the Cupid, the Cupid character, and I couldn't quite visualize it, but then I started watching it, and actually it made a lot of sense, and I rather liked it, and I thought it was pretty good. The cartoon was good enough that it sustained my interest throughout. I never felt bored, but I didn't finish watching it feeling elated. You know, there are some Warner Brothers cartoons that are great fun and really uplifting and really entertaining. This one wasn't bad, but it didn't it didn't strike me too much. I'd definitely say it's worth a watch if you're a fan of Daffy Duck or Elmer Fudd or just Warner Brothers in general. It's probably one that I will watch again at some point.